What up, YouTube? Mook out here. Uh, going about to do my uh, Saturday sports uh, review. Before we get into that, if you want to help me continue to help me to grow, if you don't mind hitting that sub button. Also, as usual, if you have a channel of your own, feel free to leave a comment down below and I will shoot you a sub since they don't cost anything. It doesn't hurt. Just, just sub, dudes. Alright, let's get in here. Uh, Ohio State and Oregon. I got to watch the last part of this game at work. Um, I feel really bad for the Ohio State quarterback. He, uh, Ohio State should have won this game. Um, they were driving super, super late. Quarterback had like 10 seconds, 14 seconds or something like that left. They ran it down the middle of the field. I'm trying to look through this and see if it says how many seconds was left. But it might have been less than 10 seconds. It, it wasn't very much either way. And basically, he fucked up. He ran too far and slid too late and time ran out. Um, if he had slid about five yards before, I think they would have been okay and it would have been a... I looked at the video, I think it would have been a round of 45 yard field goal. Obviously, no field's automatic, right? No field goal is automatic, but at least you have a chance, right? And the second after he stopped sliding and realized what he had done, it was hands to the head. I mean, you got to feel for the kid, right? But I don't know. You got to be, you got to have awareness. Game awareness. But I, I do feel bad for him, I think. I mean, like I said, no field goal is automatic, but you kind of feel like they would have hit that field goal, right? Got the, the Yoggers leading the Bears 3 nothing in London. How many London games a year do they play? Them. All right, next one's Colorado and K-State. I didn't realize Colorado had this many injuries during the game. Were they... Lose their standout player Hunter Travis Hunter, and three, three other wide receivers. That's a lot of talent lost. Three receivers and Travis Hunter. Hunter is a receiver as well, right? So they lost four receivers and only lost by three points. Whoop. Where am I going? <laughs> Where am I going? <clears throat> Why would you say injured his right shoulder? Yeah, I'm. I mean, I know Travis is really, really good. I completely disagree with him playing both sides of the ball. It's just too much wear and tear. I know he's young. I know I'm old. But that's just too much wear and tear. That'll, that'll at some point, that will catch up to him. It may not be. Until he gets into the NFL, but at some point the wear and tear will catch up to him. I'm trying to read down here to see if he is a Heisman candidate or not. I think he is. I don't think his Dion's quarterback son. I'm sure there. I think he's a candidate as well, right, for Heisman. I think both of them are. I think Shadur is probably higher up simply because he plays quarterback and all that stuff. But only losing... I wonder if they were losing like by a lot and then came back, which they have a history of doing. Alright. How do I get to the box score here? Should have just put box score. Yeah, 
Fox car. They were down 30. 24? 24 to 7 after the. That's not that bad. I lied. I can't add. 24 14. Isn't that bad? They have a really bad habit of being down uh, quite a bit and then coming back. Obviously, at the time they were four and one, right? But they seem like they they did better that that game. Uh, Tom Brady, he is him and a business partner is about to become ten percent owner of the Raiders I think 10% is what I read something like that I wonder how that's gonna work out with him broadcasting obviously he's not gonna be able to do Raider games right yeah 10% or around 10% so he's not gonna be able to do Raider games at all right I'm pretty sure that would be a conflict of interest. So what happens... What happens if the Raiders get into the playoffs? So he's not going to be able to broadcast their game then, right? That kind of sucks. Uh, and Tar I'm not even going to open that. Tar Heel wide receiver 23 dies after cancer battle. I don't want to be sad right now. 23. Dude, you're not even. 23, you're not even starting life. I know 23, at, at the time, 23 seems old. It seems like you're doing shit. I'm 49. about to be 50 here in a couple months at 23 you're not even starting life you have no clue what the fuck is even going on what well, kind of I am kind of curious to see what kind of cancer he had 23 seems young for any kind of cancer but I'm not doing it during the during the broadcast here I don't want to be Satch. <clears throat> uh, Novak got denied his 100th title. Tennis. Wah, wah. I'm just playing. I like tennis. Tennis and I are bros. Raiders flip flopping more than I flip flop on anything about whether they want to trade or keep Adams. Devontae. Adams has received interest from Epstein, but one source through ESPN is not ringing off the hook. That might be a reason why they're uh, flip-flopping then, right? I thought Devontae was a good receiver, is he not? Or is he, maybe he's got some baggage going on. You would have, you would think there would be more teams way interested in a good wide receiver, right? Especially early in the season. Man, let's check out, let's check out some football college. Uh, Penn State, Penn State is, are they like four or five or something like that? Ranked four, four to fifth. Still haven't heard anything about them all year. Just say right here. Uh, Number four, number four in the country, and you don't ever hear anything about them. Kind of weird. My Texas team ranked number one in the country. Beat OU. <clears throat> I'm always worried whenever they play because it seems like it's always they kind of go back and forth about who upsets the other one. 
most of the times I feel like OU is ranked higher than Texas in those games, but I am surprised by the 34-3. Usually they play each other pretty close. I don't, I'm not sure they have a history of blowing each other out, really. <laughs> LSU had a comeback. Uh, they were down late in the fourth quarter. I think it was 20-16. And ended up winning in overtime. Uh, score up here. Where's it at? I lost LSU. There it is. I think it was late in the fourth quarter. Oh, like it's Ole Miss. So LSU scored a touchdown, while Ole Miss only scored a field goal, which is how they got tied. And then they did the exact same thing in overtime. Ole Miss made a field goal and then LSU scored a touchdown. Trying to, <coughs> trying to see. I keep wanting to call him Chip Kelly for some reason. lost again. I think Utah's lost twice in a row now. Yeah, back to back. Back to back non-ranked teams. Hmm. What's going on in Utah? <clears throat> Penn State, USC, Georgia beat Mississippi State. Mississippi State struggling. 1-5 this year. But, like I always say, it's an SEC team, so they're capable of beating other teams. Alabama struggling again. Who did they play? Oh, they lost to Vanderbilt last week, who was unranked. They struggled this week against an unranked South Carolina game, so Bama struggling. Got a Florida, Tennessee. Tennessee, five and one, beating Florida. Right, Clemson. Clemson seems like they're having a rebound year, right? Five and one. I think last couple years they've, last two or three years they've struggled, if I remember correctly. Could be wrong. Notre Dame. I haven't heard nothing about Notre Dame this year either, and they're five and one. I wonder who they lost to. They lost in Northern Illinois. What? Ha at home. What? That's... What the hell? How are they doing? Oh, they were 2-0 at the time. What are they now? They're 4-2. Well, they're... St I mean, they're 4-2. But still... How did you lose in Northern Illinois? I don't know. Notre Dame. Notre Dame, y'all. Notre Dame. Notre. Iowa State. Don't hear nothing about Iowa State. They're 6 0. Ranked 11th in the country. BYU. Don't hear nothing about them. Blew out Arizona. Bose State. Don't hear nothing about them either. Missouri, shit, Missouri, be down, Massachusetts, 
Pittsburgh, Sadior. Wait, Pittsburgh six and zero. What the? How are they only ranked? Wait, where was that? How are they only ranked twenty two? <clears throat> I mean, they played Cincinnati, West Virginia. I mean, they played some, I mean, Youngtown State. It's a pretty small school. Kent State, I think, is a small school. But you got North Carolina, you got California, West Virginia, Cincinnati. Sadier is going to be happy. I had no idea they were six and off. Uh, Illinois, Illinois is five and one. Beat the crap out of Purdue. Didn't Purdue beat somebody? Oh, Indiana State. All right, never mind. Wah wah wah. All right, what else we got? Uh, is there any baseball? I don't think. I think they start again today, right? Yeah. NBA is not doing shit. They're doing preseason. Actually, I don't think they're even in preseason. I think they're. <laughs> professional wrestling. Whoa. Whoa. I think that's probably. I'm trying to think of any other sports. Hmm. I think that's probably going to do it for this one. Obviously, tomorrow will be the uh, Sunday wrap up, which will have the NFL games and stuff like that. Be curious to see what the rankings are for college when they come out, I expect. I expect Oregon. I thought going into the games, I thought Oregon or or Ohio State would jump Texas if Texas Oklahoma was a close game. But since they blew them out, I, I expect Texas to stay number one. Oregon should go up to number two. Penn will probably go up to three. How far does Ohio State drop? Hmm. I think Georgia will go for Ohio State will probably go down to f five. Wait, who's six? Um, Miami, did they not play? They must have been off. Yeah, they were off. Now I don't know because Miami's six and now. So I guess the question is how far does Ohio State drop, right? Bama lost and dropped six. The thing is though, all these teams won. All these teams won. No Ole Miss loss. So they might, Ohio State might drop down to nine. Probably seven, I'll say se between seven and nine. Because all these other teams are going to move up at least one. Hmm. Let me know in the comments what you think about anything that was discussed, uh, rankings, about the games, anything like that. Uh, any uh, particular sport you want me to keep an eye out for let me know anyways uh you guys take care have a good rest of your day night whatever it is for you and uh i'll get this up as soon as i can and then uh maybe later tonight i'll go ahead and do the uh the sunday one and have it up early early monday morning for y'all whenever you wake up but anyways y'all take care have a good rest of your day night whatever it is for you